Hi, I'm Liz Byron and I'm in front of Gardner Pilot Academy and in less than a month I'm going to be running 155 miles in the Sahara Desert in order to fundraise uh, for laptops for my school. Our goal is $50,000. I first heard about uh, the Marathon de Saab in 2009 when I googled the world's hardest running race and a bunch of races came up but this one seemed like the hardest to me. And then when I got a job at GPA, an incredibly cohesive well-run school, I knew that we could even we could greater enhance their education with laptops by having more access to technology. The race starts in the middle of the Sahara Desert in Morocco, and during the race you have to carry with you uh, about a 25 pound pack. All your supplies for the duration of the six day race need to be in your pack, from your food to your sleeping bag to a small cooking stove if you need to heat your food. Race mileage varies between about a marathon and 50 miles per day. I'm doing such an extreme race because while the race seems crazy, I think it's crazier that urban public school students, whom the majority of which live at or below the poverty line, don't have access to technology. That seems crazier than running 155 miles in the Sahara. So this race is a lot like a metaphor for, I think, a journey of learning and the journey through life in that It'll really challenge my human spirit, just as teaching is a profession that I think challenges and pushes the human spirit to new levels every day. The kids inspire me deeply, and I think this race will also be a source of inspiration for myself. But I hope also for my students and for others so that with determination, you, you can do anything, even the craziest of races. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> really? That's how I feel. Just pace yourself. Don't get a heat exhaustion. <laughs> Who are you going to be thinking about while you're running? Oh, I think of, we'll think about my students. <laughs>